Yes, yes, y'all, and we don't stop. Good morning. We're leaving this trailer here. I already came out and disconnected it. Disconnection. Heading to go get these stitches out. Day one of physical training. All right, we are back. Stitches are out. We are good to go. Um, just took out all the plywood that was in there. Like plywood. Found that all on the side of the road. Lauren, Lauren builds creates a whole bunch of uh, creatures and stuff for for Christmas. Not creatures. All of your favorite cartoon characters. Uh, we found this the other day. So that's cool. <clears throat> it opens up and everything. Um, so I figured that's good for something. You know what that's going to be good for? I'm, I'm doing a card show. Throw all of my cards right in there. And wheel that thing around. Oh, that's going to be mint. Oh, my partner is going to be happy. Uh, we found this the other night. Other day. See if Lauren wants it. If not, we'll sell it. It's got a price tag on the bottom of it. 40 bucks. Sell it for 30 at a discount. Bow -dow, bow -bow -dow. I took these off of uh, a ceiling fan. This has yard seal material all over. Impulse buy for the kids' bedroom. They'd be like, oh, those are so cute. I don't know how much, though. Uh, then we got all of our coils from yesterday. Do, 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 do. All right, we're going to um, change out hitches, go grab the other trailer, and we will be off to the yard. We're going to throw some of that on the trailer, too. So we'll see you then. Well, we got the other trailer out. I'm not thinking there's much in this load. 12, 1300 pounds, maybe. It would be a nice size load for the little trailer, but for this trailer, it is not much. Not much, Gus. So, anyway, it is what it is. We got to bring it in. We got to pick up today that we're going to do. But, like I told you guys, we are starting a new, healthier life. So it is push up day. We're just gonna start out with 10. So here we, oh, hold on. Back up the hat. Here we go, 10 push ups. You guys can do it with me at home too. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, Whew. when we get back we're going to do some sit-ups i'm going to try to break it up we're going to do another set of those later on today too so we will we're off to the yard I'm showing you guys this now don't think there's going to be much to bring to jeffy but we'll see so see you guys in a little bit all right so we kept the lock box one of the fans um, all this stuff. Yeah. We have this whole thing of batteries and stuff. Let's see if they charge up. Um, and my guys want this, so. Bada bing, bada boom. That's what it is. So we'll see you guys here in a little bit. Look at that guy playing. Playing on his little, little claw. Alright, here we go. We got this, uh, this trailer hooked back up. We got the other one dropped. We pulled the <laughs> we pulled the stove off, and we have this heat pump. This is a long one. I like this one. So we we'll end up pulling that out and pulling that out on Thursday. So we have a little bit of time before we go do our next pickup, and then we picked up a service call. So it's gonna be a busy afternoon. Um, it is gonna be, uh, maybe we'll just leave this thing hooked up. The service call is only right down the street, so I may just leave this thing hooked up. Or we may come back. After we go to the mechanic, we're gonna go pick up a load. Then maybe we'll come back and drop it. And then I gotta head over to the service call. It's local right in the area, so. Yes, we are on our way, on our way. I think it's time to do sit-ups. Let's do some sit-ups. Uh, so we're gonna, the goal is 50 for the day. 
So, as you see, we're gonna start busting things out and set. Let's see. Where can we put you? There you go. You're doing it right in the dirt. I don't even know if you guys can see me. Hopefully you can. 25 sit-ups. Here we go. Crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, So that's gonna come in time. <coughs> so, here we go. One set of 25 down, one set of 10 push ups down. Uh, we have a three mile bike ride to do later on. And yes, so getting on our way, on our way back to being healthy. I can't wait. We're gonna test these batteries. I'll let you know how it goes. We found these. So let's, let's plug them in, test them. All right, I think this is a score. Look, boom, all lights up. Boom, all lights up. That one three light up, but when you put it on the charger, it reads full. Four amp hour and four amp hour. Boom, they all light up and those work. So I just got done and I posted them on Marketplace. For 200 bucks or best offer, I will happily take 150. Um, so that ended up being a really good pickup. Now it makes me think that 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 lawnmower was fine, and I threw away a perfectly good cobalt lawnmower. So I guess that's a lesson for another time that we're going to start checking these things if we can. Um, so yeah, maybe the person just wasn't into it or. Maybe there was something wrong with that, but there isn't something wrong with the batteries. I don't know. I don't know. But we got to post it. Hopefully we get some kind of reaction out of it and see what happens. So we have about 20 more minutes and then we are off. So we will probably bring you in or we'll bring you in afterwards. One of the two. See you in a little bit. Beep, beep, beep. There it is. We had gotten a call from one of our pool companies and I was like, yep. I'm there. Go grab the hand truck. That's number three. Number three for you and for me. Grab this hand truck real quick. I gotta start doing something with this stuff. I gotta get in the shed. I don't think it's, it's definitely not happening today. Tomorrow, I don't think it's happening either. So, we're gonna throw that right there. Three heat pumps so far. Very good. We're on our way. See you guys in a little bit. We're heading to the mechanic now. It's getting cloudy. All right, we're back. Let's see if you can see under there. Not a whole lot of cast, but we got some uh, good aluminum on this one. Got three hoods. Supposedly, I think this one's aluminum. So, I mean, we're not angry about that. Oh, yeah. That's going to be that. So, we got to pick up the ladder real quick. And then I'm off to a service call. I have to um, go check. What the hell is that? You don't want none of this drama. I have to go uh, check out a pool real quick and see what's going on with it. We got a leaky, leaky, leaky. So see what see what all we have to do with. It. We'll bring you back here in a little bit. Oh, that's a smudge. Where did that smudge come from? Ooh, I wonder how long that thing's been there. Anyway, uh, yes. 
So I'm back in the car again. So we went over to this service call. Um, I had worked for this guy a couple times before. Um, so it, he said the panel was leaking, so I just grabbed my panel stuff and went over there. And of course, it turns out it's the pipe that's leaking. So I'm not charging them, but I had to run home real quick and grab some couplings. Luckily, home is only about seven minutes away. So we jumped over there, grabbed some couplings, and I'm gonna cut this thing out. I grabbed another ladder too. Um, so I'm gonna cut this thing out. I'll try to bring you with me. I don't think you'll have a beef with it. Um, but yeah, we'll cut out the coupling the, because the coupling cracked. It goes coupling to an adapter. So we gotta cut that thing out, add in another coupling, so now you gotta put two couplings in. Ugh, make sure the pipe ain't swollen in that spot. It's a whole thing. So that's what we're gonna go do. And then after that, we got uh, off of Facebook. Of course, just like anything else in Florida, try to do something and it's gonna rain. So we have to cut this piece out here. And then also right there, we have to seal that up. It was lifting like that far off the roof. So we put in a new piece, cut it there, cut it there. Good to go. I'm going to go test it right now ah, in the rain. Don't leave your glue in the gutters. Just so you guys know. All right. Well, yeah, now we got another call to go to after this. So see you in a little bit. So we just got done on the quote. Slippery ass black roof. Um, but I mean the system didn't look too awful bad so we'll go ahead and get them quoted out for a removal and a reinstall and now we are heading home to finish exercising hopefully it's not raining when we get there because I'm tired and beat I want to be done so we still owe three miles 10 push-ups and 20 sit-ups yay all right, well, once we get over there, we'll bring you along with us. You know we will. 25 setups. We did 25 this morning. Woohoo! All right, well, back here at the house, and usually I rock the head strap all the time, but it's been hurting my neck while I was riding, so we got this thing going. And, uh,. That's going to be you guys' new home on the rides. Let's see. Yeah. I think that's going to work out quite nicely. You guys can go full on. Boom, and I ain't got to worry about it. Look at that. All right. All right, all right, all right. We'll adjust it a little bit. A little adjustment never hurt nobody. Hopefully everything stays out of your way. And there you go. So let's go for a bike ride. About my ride. Oh, and Virginia workout. workout, boy. We are on. Three miles today. Three miles with the phone dinging. And then as soon as we get back, we're knocking out the rest of our exercises and now I'm going to sleep. Hello, birds. pretty happy about the holder on this and I don't have to hold it <laughs> especially on my head three miles today
be another one mile mark. Two miles, two miles. I took a lot to get that one again. I was at the two mile mark. Legs, come on, burn it. Oh, yeah, coming down the home stretch, coming down the home stretch, people. There you go. That's the best we've done. Yeah, that's the best we've done. That's the best we've done. Last mile. We just killed it. Killed it on the last mile. Ooh, good stuff. Alright guys. See you when we get back in.
Oh, I never hit the button. You guys are still alive. Live and direct. Woo, hold on. I'm gonna take you out there you guys can look at me. Yeah, that was a pretty good little workout. Nothing too crazy. Still talk fine afterwards, that's what we're looking for. Still being able to talk afterwards, still be able to complete sentences. All that's nuts, so we didn't push it too hard today. You, there will definitely be times when I cannot talk to you afterwards, after some of these runs and stuff, so. It's coming, it's coming, folks. I just gotta not get injured, and uh, yeah, keep on keeping on. All right, but well, we got push-ups and sit-ups to do, so let's get to the push-ups first. Uh, remember, we're only doing two sets to start. This is just a start, so anybody who needs this sort of thing in their life, this is a great time to start right now. We're just chilling, we're just doing simple things and we'll build on it together as a team. So, 10 push-ups. If you're gonna get into doing it, it's 20 push-ups a day for the first week. 20 push-ups a day, you can break them up, break them up into fives. You know, break them up into twos and just do, you know, what are we doing? 20 totals, we'll do 10 sets of two. Whatever you gotta do to get it done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then 25 crunches. I did 25 earlier. Here we go. Oh, ah, ah, ah. That's 25. Oh, I'm so out of shape. That is devastating. Whew. All right. Well, that's that. Let's wrap this thing up. Yeah, so that's the end of the day. Uh, let's go over what we did today. We woke up, got our stitches out first thing this morning. Then we came back, we picked up Scrabzilla, went and dumped that. Um, that came out to 15, no, f yeah, oh, 15.50 as far as poundage. See, it was slow on Sunday. It was slow. Sunday was a slow day. Um, and then we came back here, and then uh, we got the stove off. Got the stove off. Uh, then we ran out and got that heat pump. And then we went to the trailer. We picked up all the stuff on the trailer. Then we came back here. We went and did a service call. Um, what happened after the service call? Oh, and then we went and did a quote. I got to write out that quote. Then we came back and I just stuffed down one taco just because I needed it. And then uh, three mile bike ride, 20 push-ups today, 50 sit-ups total. We broke them down into sets, push-ups with two sets of 10, squats, I mean uh, crunches with two sets of 25. So like I said, it's our first week back. I really can't get the green light to start acting crazy until the 18th of October when I go see my heart doctor. But never too soon to start getting in shape you know what I mean so all the stuff that we're doing right now I don't really feel like we're putting a crazy stress on ourselves you know as you can see we can still talk afterwards um, all that so a little bit at a time but this is where it starts this is where it starts Woo! what a day what a day quote of the day what is the quote of the day the quote of the day is show up for yourself show up for yourself because you are worth it um and those are the goals those exercises right now my goals is exercise so i'm showing up for myself every day once again this bike ride at the end of the day that is treacherous you get to get around a four or five o'clock and i'm like yo i don't want to do that but i'm glad i did i feel good right now i feel good i feel you know up so show up for yourself show up for yourself you you'll be glad that you did i promise so until next time, thanks for watching. You guys are the best. I really appreciate it. Um, thanks for dealing with me and my life and where this whole thing is going. You know, it's not as much scrapping as it used to be. And that's okay. I'd even like to get into doing some interviewing on this channel. Um, we're going to do a bunch of stuff. And exercise is coming. This is going to be a, a big part of what we're doing here. Getting back in shape. You guys are watching from day one. Um... I think I'm right about 167 pounds, somewhere in there. So we're going to keep track of that. The goal weight is 145. Uh, when I ran my half marathon, I was down to 144. Like a month ago, month, month and a half ago, I was up at 170. That's the heaviest I've ever been. So we're, we're in it now. We're in it to win it. Let's head to the 150s because we need it in our life. So. Have a good day. Till the next time. 
We'll see you later. Goodbye.